Oh, first catch on the micro chatterbait. Shoo, and it's a good one. All right, let's get out of here. Definitely kicked my butt. Only landed one fish a piece, but yours was a much larger specimen. come fishing today but then I realized I was like oh yeah the forecast says it's gonna be freezing cold the next few days so probably not gonna want to go fishing the next few days you're gonna want to go fishing today exactly still really warm yeah. first day of the year might as well right what the water's down a little bit uh yeah definitely looks like it those roots weren't exposed. oh yeah for sure the opening over there is oh shoot that was a that was a fish we just scared you see that yeah god dang it that was a mistake should have cast before we walked up looks nice don't it a little mini chatterbait looks beautiful So much stuff on the surface, and the water is pretty far down actually, even further than I thought. Yeah. We gotta get over to that bigger side. This is so hard to fish right now. Wow, yeah, this water is falling fast. Water's usually up over these rocks right here. All this grass right here, you can see it's freshly receded, but man, that should really mean that they're all out here towards the middle then. I don't like the lack of wind here. There's no wind at all right now, actually. Zero wind. Oh no, are you kidding me? Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I just had to do that. Now I gotta walk all the way over there. Hopefully get it out of this tree. Just barely not too deep for my waders. Oh, there we go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, no. I do have a hole in my waders, though. My left leg is getting soaked now. Oh, come on. Stupid thing, get off of there. There we go. Alright. That was quite the ordeal. Oh no, now I hung over that limb. Are you kidding me right now? Oh. Come on. Alright, let's not hit any more limbs with our whopper flopper. Golly. So much stuff on the surface, I can't even do this thing, man. All right. I don't want to do it, but I'm cutting the whopper plopper off. Huh? I know, right? I never, I never give up on the whopper plopper. Well, I am right now, because there's just so much stuff on the surface, it can't run right. Tying a little finesse spinner bait. Hopefully this won't get so much stuff hung up on it. Oh 
man. I'm gonna walk around the other side already, to the deeper side. I think with this water falling so fast, they might be going over that way. Oop, there was a bite. Dang it, what was that all about? almost like a perch bite it was like might have been hitting the blades or something I don't know hmm that was weird definitely a bite of some sort all right I'm gonna tie this whopper plover back on so I'm gonna throw it in that other pond over the hill real quick doesn't have as much debris on the surface over there Oh man, I hear people mowing the lawns over there. Oh man, it's somebody running a chainsaw. I don't know what they're doing, but I'm gonna be making a lot of noise while I'm trying to fish. In the Amazon, the Amazon reviews, people were saying this thing's good for panfish. What kind of panfish are you catching? Big old crappie, probably. Oh! Nice! Woo. Right in front of you, huh? Yep. You wasn't very far out right from the there. bank. It's like right behind the... Yep. Nice! <laughs> that is a healthy yeah, boy. A freaking good one. Uh -huh. Nice. Wait, wait, hold on. Don't take it out. Take a picture. <laughs> yeah, true. Perfect. <laughs> nice dude he's healthy look how fat yeah. <laughs> he freaking stomped it too i barely yeah. set the hook he just... <laughs> <laughs> nice golly look how fat oh look at his his dorsal fin all messed up oh, yeah. nice well, thank you mama <laughs> Wow. Nice. Sweet. First catch on the micro. First catch on the micro chatterbait. Shoo. And it's a good one. Well, that was a good purchase, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say a good $3 spent. Hmm. I can just not get a bite on this whopper plopper right now. It's blowing my mind. We've had a very, very unusually warm December, so this water is not cold at all. In fact, in some places around here, a lot of the fish, at least the males, are acting like they want to spawn already. There's a bunch of beds already down there at Choke Canyon Reservoir, so a lot of these little ponds around San Antonio, if it continues to stay pretty warm in the near future, this spawn's going to be really early this year. So I'm very surprised that I haven't got a bite on this whopper plopper. It's pretty weird. My brother got one on that chatterbait right where I was casting my whopper plopper. So it's almost like they don't want to break the surface right now for whatever reason. But I don't know. I have only got that one bite, so it's not really that much of a indicator. But the fact that he caught it right where I threw my bait was an indicator of that individual fish for sure. Guarantee that fish knew that my whopper plopper existed before he bit that little chatterbait. Well, pretty much fished around both of these ponds now without a single bite in this whopper plopper, so I'm gonna cut it off again. This time I'm tying on a little rattle trap. Just something different than his chatterbait there. I have a little finesse spinnerbait, but that's pretty darn similar to his chatterbait so I'm gonna just be throwing something a little bit different so rattle trap is another good fall winter time bait you can rip it out of grass and stuff get a lot of reaction bites from it Ooh. 
<laughs> a little tiny guy right in front of me again just like yours but mine's much smaller little rattle trap fish yeah oh wow he's got some really green pretty green spots all over his face really iridescent one on top of his head too that's cool pretty little guy all right let's get out of here definitely kicked my butt only landed one fish a piece but yours was a much larger specimen mm -hmm.